uh, so supreme knowledge drop uh, part one uh, but before we start with the supreme knowledge drop the knowledge of electromagnetism the field uh, we need to start with just getting some common understandings going and for now uh, let's get some pictures going uh, <clears throat> we have the magnetic field from science okay we have um, the electromagnetic field uh, this is 90 degrees to each other and so we have this sort of effect. This one's a bit more vertical. So that's the description of electromagnetism 90 degrees to each other and almost implies a propagation direction that goes like that then we have um, knowledge of light which is that light exits a point like so and we also know let's make it a little smaller light exit a point in straight lines and we also know that light is part of the of EM spectrum okay so so if this is light then there's magnetism there's electromagnetism and uh, We've not really fully tied all this together. Oh, we've also got Steinmetz. So Steinmetz is the next one. Steinmetz put together a view like this that said, if you consider a, this is a piece of copper wire. So we're going to color that in. Now you're looking the piece of copper wire down the eye. And this is uh, carrying electricity at the moment. So what you would notice in this, when you look down the wire, you will see two fields. You will see A, a magnetic field, and B, uh, let's draw it in a different color. A radiative or dielectric field. Now actually, let's remove those lines. He didn't have lines, he just had that. So this is more or less where we are. As you can see from this, not really a unified view. We also have things like wave particle duality. And this happens when, let's see if we can draw it. I wonder if I can draw it. Uh, wave particle duality plus we have photons. And what we have here is that also space has no quality. No qualities. And there's no medium for EM. So for, for actually for electromagnetism, uh, if, if full spectrum EM is emitting from the sun and propagating towards us, as we understand it, in straight lines and this gets to us then um, it, space is nothing the, for, according to science and the only I guess point of departure for me is I'm saying space is so super fine so subtle it does have structure it does have uh, it has an obvious shape it has to have that shape uh, and w once you understand it and embrace it, everything else makes much more sense. So for now, this is lesson one. 
and this we're going to call it a recap recap of where we are let me stop recording we'll do the second recording immediately